What's up guys, back for the top three November setups to go crappie fishing with. You know, fall's been great, October was fantastic. We had a lot of warm weather, just really nice days out. Starting here in November, we've got some major cold fronts coming in. So that tells me a couple different things that I'm gonna have to adjust to keep on catching crappie. One is I'm gonna downsize and I'm gonna slow down a lot of days. So these three setups, I'm gonna go through them and actually show you how I'm preparing to fish these major cold fronts coming in in November. So make sure you hit subscribe, turn your notifications on. Appreciate everybody. Let's get to it. In the flat land like a man. Hey guys number one setup for the month of november for me when it comes to catching crappie especially when you have these cold fronts hitting us will be live scoping using a single jig now i'm using a 16 foot b m black diamond just a great live scoping pole that you can get out there and put these baits right in front of these fish has a really good backbone so you can really set the hook and bring them right in on the reel itself is a Bass Pro Shops Crappie Max, just a mini bait caster. I like to use 12 pound fluorocarbon when it comes to catching live scope crappie. Now this setup in the month of November, I lightened up a little bit. So I'm wanting a really slow presentation to bring these baits right into these fish without spooking them. So I'm using a, a quarter ounce egg sinker about 12 inches up above my jig itself i like to use two bobber stops on each side just to really peg that weight in place so it drops it drops exactly where it's supposed to without moving up and down your line and on the bottom of the line i'm just using a 16th ounce overbite crappie pro jig head just tied with a little loop knot three colors that i'm really utilizing this month i believe will be the tried and true color monkey milk cajun cricket and also live minnow three great colors to use whenever you're presenting these baits to these fish the bait of my choice right now in this month of november will be the bobby garland itty bit slab hunters i catch fish with these baits regardless from the summertime to the winter time one of the questions that I always get asked is what size baits to use depending on what time of year cold fronts like we're having right here in november right now i'm gonna downsize like i said earlier so i'm gonna go to this inch and a quarter length bait just a very small profile and using it on a 1 16th ounce jig head but it's a great way to go catch these fish whenever these big cold fronts are hitting them and you need a smaller lighter presentation All right guys, my number two setup for the month of November will be spider rigging. I'm gonna go back to my roots. The only thing different now is I'm gonna use live scope. I'm gonna have my poles out front and I'm gonna just slowly push these baits right to them. Typically spider rigging with this setup, I'm gonna go anywhere from about 0.2 all the way to about 0.6, gonna be on the top end of things. Now my setup here is I'm gonna use a 16 foot B&M VGJP real sensitive pole gets these light bites if these fish will hardly breathe on them you're going to see the bite on these bgjps i'm using just a spinner reel at the end with 10 pound mono and i'm tying it to an inline sinker this is a half ounce then below the half ounce i'm using a six pound mono now i take it about 15 inches below the inline sinker and then i'm going to tie me a 1 16th ounce moglo overbite jig head now this gives me a lot of options to use here either i can just rig it with a minnow or i can put different baits on it now the bait that i'm really looking forward to using this fall would be the new bobby garland live roamers it gives me two different options on how i'm presenting these baits to these fish one i'm gonna rig it just traditional just straight up and down looking just like a live minnow and as it's being pulled through the, the water it's just going to give that side to side motion of a, of a little bait fish swimming along the other way that i want to 
rig it is actually just flat especially if you have a little chop on the water and you have these poles bouncing a little bit it's going to give that presentation of that bait fish just flopping up and down like a dime minnow looks but that is the new live roamer couple baits of choice lights out double silver rainbow there's bleeding shed definitely gonna be a good color for me this fall all right guys my number three setup for the month of november is going to go back to my roots now i'm going to use a seven and a half foot b m 75th series spinning rod all i like using is a six pound mono one of the things that makes this setup really easy is this steel bobber as you can see on there it shows you 1 16th ounce so all you got to do is take it out of the package run it through your line tie your bobber stop up top to the depth that you want it and take you a 1 16th ounce jig head and tie it on the bottom of the line very simple setup very effective get you in that strike zone and it will hold it there i really like this setup on bridges and different brush piles that the bait just needs to stay there right there with them and the month of november is a prime time to do this cast and slip bobbers for crappie here's two different profiles that i really like to use whenever i'm using a slip bobber setup one will be this top hat jigs one and a half inch guppy gobbler now two colors that i really like will be number one the hilltopper and the white and chartreuse heady bug these are really two good colors that they produce that really work in all different water conditions the other is the tried and true bobby garland baby shad and that is in the fried shad color all right guys there's my top three setups for the month of november temperatures are changing cold fronts are coming through change up your presentations and keep crappie fishing make sure you hit that subscribe share it with your buddies hit us some comments what is your favorite way to catch crappie in the month of november appreciate everybody watching every month till next time you got brad chapel here holla fishing pole. here i rest my soul i can feel